I want to show you how to configure Galaxy Touch Screen on CentOS 6.6. .6. Open up a terminal session, um, log in as um, log in as root. Download this file. You need this file um, to extend your uh, YUM repository. Um, after you download and install this file, you can then um, install the calibration program uh, needed to configure your uh, Galaxy Touch. Um, Galaxy Touch interface module it's already incorporated um, in the CentOS 6.6 .6. um, I believe CentOS 6.5 um, it's all already has a module but um, I'm not 100% sure but certainly it works on my CentOS 6.6 .6. so um, you don't need to install anything the uh, the program that we are going to do is to um, is to calibrate the the touch screen. This show you this just to show I already have um, uh, downloaded the file previously. Anyway, once it is downloaded, you you can then uh, use this line to install the um, install the RPM file. And then once the RPM file is installed, go ahead and install the um, the X input calibrator. This is the program we're going to use to calibrate your touch screen. I already have this program installed previously so it's it's going to show it's already installed so nothing going to happen right now my finger is moving up and down and the mouse is moving in the opposite direction and my finger is moving sideways right now and as you see the the mouse pointer is moving exactly the opposite direction my touch screen is swapped axis is swapped and in a move and moving in an opposite direction I need to know this in order to update my calibration file which I'm going to show you uh, later type this line on your terminal to start the calibration process what the calibration program does is to is uh, creating is to create a syntax the syntax we need to copy into a script file which the X terminal will use for the touch screen um, for the galaxy touch you are going through the calibration process just follow the screen uh, touch those cross target um, on the screen. Once completed, the program will output this information on the screen. We need to copy the information onto the configuration file.
the file must be in this program, this folder, in order for the touch screen to work. Paste, paste the information under this file. As I mentioned earlier, the program doesn't seem to generate the necessary information to swap and invert the access. So we need to add those information manually onto the calibration file. Once you have saved the file, um, reboot your computer, and you sh you should your touchscreen should should come up um, calibrated. Anyway, um, thank you for watching.